tiptoe, yeah. The In the club, got them bottles on replay. Trying to break a record like a DJ. What's going on, y'all? It's your boy TK, and I'm back, boy. Man, I'm feeling so much better. Man, I'm feeling so much better. I still got the coughs. I still got the the sniffles. I still kind of got the the headache. Somewhat, the headache's not so much. It's not as bad as it was. But man, either way, I'm still feeling. I'm still getting better. Thank you to everyone who's been um telling me to get better and all that good stuff. Man, you already know it's still flu style kind of commentary. You already know it is week seven. I believe season six or season seven. One of them, one of them Jones. I'm not even sure. This one, this is kind of like a rivalry game because you know it's the it's the Cincinnati Bengals against um, the Pittsburgh Steelers. You see me right there, man. I don't know how I made it out. You see me right there taking a the slide just because you gotta play it. You gotta play it safe with my dude Steve Young because he's either fumbling or he's either uh, he's either get injured or that, I don't know what that man. He could be great, and then he has this moments where he could just be terrible. He could be wrong. Everything that could go wrong, everything that could just be wrong, Steve Young could definitely do that for you. My man in the comment section, I forgot who it was. He said he sold his Steve Young a long time ago, and I'm not. I'm not gonna lie. I really don't see any other quarterbacks out there. Um, I'm not gonna say that's better than Steve Young. I'm not gonna say nothing like that. It's just I don't really don't see anybody out there. For me to invest in like that, I'm fine with Steve Young. I, I was rocking with Auto Graham for the longest. You see me in the red zone with my team, my dude CJ2K. I'm trying to get a pop right there. You see him making a nice little stop against my options. So, right here, I'm throwing it to who else? Who else would I throw the ball to? I'm gonna throw it to my dude FB. I'm gonna throw it to my dude Freddie. My dude Fred, Mr. I never dropped nothing. He got me in the end zone. When have you guys, it's been a, probably a long time, or never, when have you guys seen me as my opening touchdown throw a touchdown? It's normally always my fast break offense. So, there you go. For the, my people who keep saying, nice interception. Why would he throw that, though? I don't understand why he threw it. But uh, I'm not complaining. You see right there, getting out, of the, getting out of bounds with my dude LT because I'm not taking no chances. People get injured way too quick. No users, shawty. What are you doing? What are you doing? You really thought you was going to catch my dude CJ2K? Right there, you see me acting a straight donkey as I get in the end zone. Man, making it look too easy. Like I was saying, I don't even know the last time I threw a touchdown. It was my opening touchdown right there. My man, Antonio Camardi, he had some popcorn before the end of the game. Patrick Willis had some popcorn before the end of the game. Man, we just dropping a football out here. He ends up dropping a ball. So basically, I'm thinking we got to open a wide open touchdown. That wasn't the case. So I think on this drive, I ended up selling for a field goal. Don't quote me. I think I do end up selling for a field goal on this drive. Right here, I had my dude FB wide open. So I ended up just dropping the ball to my dude LaShawn McCoy, Shady McCoy to be exact. Like I said, I just ended up taking my points. Y'all know me, I'll take my points, not a problem. And um, as you see my dude EJ Manuel on the field and whatnot, my dude EJ Manuel, he 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 get to see the field, man. Every time we score, every time we go for a field goal, my man gets to see the field. So, man, you know, I haven't been on, I, I ain't going to say I haven't been on. I haven't talked about World Star in a minute. If you, if you were the original Hashtag Trail Team members from back in the day, I'm talking back when I had 40 subs before Sports CMM, before Sports CMM. I used, to be, I used to talk about World Star a lot. So I've been getting asked about it for a minute. So I was like, you know, I'll just wait till I see something that's interesting for me to talk about, right? Right there, I don't know how this fool ended up making that pass. Now he in my red zone before I get to the World Star. You see, he's one of those types. He one of them types that will run to the outside. He'll hike and haul. One of them type of Jones. So right here, he ends up. <sighs> I hate playing against these kind of players, yo. But, anyways. So he ends up scoring. He ended up getting the ball back after the uh, second quarter was over. You know, we're in the second half, so now he gets the ball back. So 
in a way, if he scores, he's back in this game. No lie. So, let's see how it goes. So, recently, just now, I was watching. I don't know if it's real. I mean, the dude looked dead on him. So, I, I'm thinking it's real. But just now, I was watching a video from Dwayne Wade's son. I, I don't know. I don't know if it's true. But dang, if he don't look dead on him, no. If you guys haven't seen it, check it out on World Star. This is a young dude, 21 years old. He say he's Dwayne Wade's son and whatnot. He looked dead on Dwayne Wade. I mean, he looked like Dwayne Wade with some dreads. Not even gonna lie. You know what I'm saying? All he need is uh, just to cut his hair and put an earring in, and you got Dwayne Wade off top. I don't know. I was watching the video. And he was talking about uh, Dwayne Wade had his first little one, which is him at 13. You know what I'm talking about? Like, dang, Dwayne Wade was getting in at 13. As you see this fool, for whatever reason, the thirst just got too real for my man. So he went for it on the fourth down when he could have just took. My man could have just took his points and then kept it moving. But the thirst just got too real for him. Right here, you see me on the third. Uh, it was about third and long. I didn't make it. Fourth and one. My defense has been doing pretty darn well for me, so I just went ahead and punted the ball. Y'all know me. I'm not tripping at all. Sim style football. It's not an issue. Man, my nose is killing me, yo. My nose is on one right now. Anyway, so right here, he ends up making a long pass, and he ends up getting it. I was thinking I had a cool little interception, but that wasn't the case, which is not an issue. What not? I want to say it's Thurman Thomas. Um... Maybe Walter Payton, I'm not even sure. Like I was saying, man, that World Star jump, that video, it, it looked dead. That that dude looked dead on Dwayne Wade, yo. If you ain't see it, you need to check it out. I'll probably put the link in the description so you guys are, uh, don't have to search for it or nothing right there. Come on, popcorn hands. Damn, Gina, man. Everybody just drops the football. See, and that's the thing that I don't like, yo. I hate that. It's not my fault my players got popcorn hands. And look at that. Like, when... I don't get a chance to capitalize on something. EA penalizes me. So you know what I do? I get a ball right to my dude. Mike All-Star A-Train to be exact. And he, he just gets it popping. Right here, my dude. Steve Young, y'all see that pancake block by my dude Nick Mangle, though? God, I love the blocking on my team, yo. And that's another thing. Y'all need to stop saying there's a secret to my offense. I don't know why y'all keep saying that. There's no secret to my offense. I'm showing you everything that I have. Like, I don't understand that. How is there a secret to my offense? And I'm showing you my offense. I don't understand, like, if I was, like, some underground dude that y'all didn't know about and I just so happen to be heard about through the grapevine and everybody's like, oh, this, that, and the third fast break offense. Um, y'all need to check it out. He only comes around once in the blue mood or something like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got to understand if I only came around, like, once in the blue mood. I show you all my games. So how is there a secret to my offense? There's no secret to my offense. It's just point blank, period. I, I'm sorry to say, but a lot of y'all just ass. Like it's just that. It's just that. It's just that simple. That a lot of people are just ass at the game. Like my man right here. You see him on the third and goal. He ends up dropping the ball. Look what he does on the fourth and goal. What are you doing? So first of all, there was two people in that area. Why would you throw it? So right here, he ends up calling a timeout, right? As you see, he called a timeout. He thought he had me. You never had me. Look at my dude FB. I told y'all. He don't drop nothing. I love that dude, Fred, man. Freddie B. He, that dude got sure hands for days, yo. Big huge shots out to that dude, man. That's a good dude right there. That's a that's a that's a loyal dude right there. You see right here, we end up basically just running the ball, letting the ball go down. Then, of course, I'm going to throw a monkey wrench in there. Since you like to go on fourth downs, I'm going to go ahead and call a timeout. Sim style football, shout it. I got to kick the field goal. You know me. I send the message. That's what I do. I am the creator of after the game messages. That's what I do. No fourth downs, though. That thirst is too real. Hashtag Gatorade season. You already know, man. You already know we still out here winning. As my dude Steve Young with the fake like touchdown he just got, he should have got tackled. But he gets a GMC never say never moment of the game. You already know, man. It's been real. It's been trill. We still do a flu style type of commentaries. It's your boy TDK, and I'm out.